Okay, good morning. Okay, did you have a nice chat? Yes. Okay, so today we are going on with the fractions. Do you guys have any questions about the fractions? No, nothing. Do you guys understand fractions? Yes, you think so. Okay, let's see. So, what date is it today? Can you guys tell me? The 14th, and which number month is it? Let's count. January, February, March, yes, five. January, February, March, April, May. So it's the fifth month. Nay, Okay. Okay, so now you guys can turn off your um, your speakers. I'm quickly going to explain fractions and then we're going to do an activity, okay? So turn off your speakers again. Okay. <coughs> okay, so we have 10 pieces of chocolate. And now we're sharing it between five kids. So you get two, you get two, you get two, you get two, and you get two. So we had five kids, ten pieces of chocolate, and now each person got two pieces. So how would you write it as a fraction? We would write it as two on 10. Okay, let me just put it closer for you guys. We would write it as 2 over 10. Okay, if we have four pieces of chocolate and we get one piece of chocolate each, we would write it as 1 of 4 pieces. Do you guys agree? So, show me a thumbs up if you agree. Okay, <laughs> okay, so now we're quickly going to go through it all again with this thingy. So one whole piece can be divided into two pieces. This is one half, this is the second half. It can be divided into three pieces, a third, a second third, and a third a third part of the th three parts. So that's a whole. Then it can be divided into quarters, into fifths, into sixes, into eighths, into tenths, and into twelves. Okay, so this one piece divides into various pieces and we write it as one of the twelve pieces. If we took these two, it would be two of the 12 pieces, 3 of the 12, so the 3 would be the numerator and 12 is the denominator, okay, so turn your speakers back on, okay, I'm going to ask you guys questions and then you must help me, okay, so this one, one is colored in but there are four blocks, so one of the four. So how do we write it, Kanya? Kanya, how do we write one of four? Yeah, it's because your speaker is on. Love it. Amaria, you can turn yours off because your brother is a bit noisy. Okay. That should help. Okay. That should help. It's basically also the laptop. Okay. <laughs> okay, Kanya, how do we write it if one of four pieces are colored in? How do we write it? Yeah, you're proper because of the noise. Okay, can you hear me better now? Oopsie. Where did she go?
Okay, Shani, let's see if you can do it. How do we write a fraction when one of four pieces are colored in? Shani? Shani, man. How do we cut? How do we write the fraction if one of four pieces is colored in? Okay, let me help you. So one piece is colored in. So that's the part that is colored in. So it goes on top. And there are four blocks, so that's the whole. The whole thing has four blocks, and only one of them is colored in. So it's a quarter that's colored in. Okay, do you understand, Shani? Yeah. Okay, now let's see. Three pieces are colored in, and the whole is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, um, Kanya, what goes on top? Uh, if we have if we have three pieces that are colored in, and there are seven pieces in the whole slab of chocolate, how do we write that only three pieces are colored in? The part that is colored in is three, okay? So part of the whole is three. And the whole slab is seven. So then seven goes to the bottom. Three is the numerator and seven is the denominator, okay? Do you understand? Okay. Now we have some more. We colored in four four pieces and there was eight pieces so four is the part that is colored in and eight is the whole circle okay so now we have to color in three of the seven pieces so what do we color in um, we color in the three you color in three blocks Okay, now we have six pieces and we need to color in four pieces. So four of six. So what do we do with the circle? We color the four. We color four in. So one, two, three, four of the six pieces is colored in. And then if we simplify it, we can say, okay, how many of the circle is colored in? We can simplify it, say divide by two, divide by two, and then two of three pieces are colored in, okay? Um, then we're gonna add fractions. So if we have three of eight pieces plus Okay, Amaria has three pieces of the chocolate and Shani has two pieces of the chocolate and there are eight pieces in the chocolate. How many do Shani and Amaria have together? You can show me with your fingers, Amaria, if you know the answer. What's three plus two? Shani, what's three plus two? Five. Yes, five. And we don't say eight plus eight because the chocolate slab only has eight pieces. You can't suddenly have 16 pieces. So you still have eight pieces, but Shani and Amara put their pieces of chocolate together. Okay. And then... A difficult one. This is one you were doing in grade three. Let's see if you guys can do it. If we have two pieces of apple and Shani has three pieces of apple, but the apple is only sliced, 
into four pieces. We are going to have another apple. So we have one whole apple and then we cut another apple so that Shani can also get one piece. Okay. Do you guys understand? Yes. Okay. Yes. So will you guys be able to do your worksheet? Yes. Today you have a worksheet on fractions. If you struggle, you can just voice note me, okay? Okay. Okay, bye. 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 Enjoy your day. <laughs> Sorry, Maria. Uh, join. Join. Join the meeting. If you tap on the screen, there you go. <laughs> Bye. Yeah.